I mean, imagine having car now and the next moment, pew, just. Sunday morning. So I went to make my hair. I remember vividly, you guys. It was such a very crazy experience. So a little PSA. Before I start this vlog proper, you know I said in my last video that I have some couple of top videos in my hard drive. But even before I posted that video, right? Because the video has been in my hard right. drive got um, I don't know if it's corrupted, I would say, but point is I've been trying so hard to get back all my videos that has been on it. I mean that's one of the cons of storing a lot of videos for a long time without editing it. And it's just because I didn't have so much time to edit it. But that being said, I have like video ideas for my car videos and I know I've had a lot of requests, right? And I'm really working on them and this particular video you're watching is one of them right so if you have so many other requests that you want me to film or make please drop it in the comment section because i have a lot of videos in that hard drives that has not even you know seen the limelight so for now i'll just make do of what i have and based on your recommendation i'll start filming videos that you want thanks <music> that this video okay welcome back to my channel let me just this one wake up you guys there are some people that when they are driving they used to do this thing like they are literally driving in lagos and they will be making up why driving i mean like on the express or on the road maybe like little traffic but not really little like that i wonder how they do because you guys like i have not even tried concentrating on driving dig like i'm trying to focus on how to know how to drive perfectly I will not be making up. Some people are just good, like Guru Sha, but in any case, it doesn't mean that it's a good thing because, see, I know I didn't rub so much. I'm hurrying to go out. What is this thing? Okay, so I'm actually hurrying out and I just want to do this quick uh, video, like, for you guys. So, yeah, um, it's basically like a story time. Quite recent, but not that recent. Sure. I was when they stole our car. Let's just call this a conversation, okay? I don't know if I'm looking at this. Um, camera but yeah i think i am a quick one it's a, so there was a time like if you guys watch this channel very well you know like we had a red car more like red like this kind of like red wine color burgundy shell that was the car we were using before so we parked outside overnight I, I can't forget the date it was october no 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 it was august 28th i think was it 2021 was it last year Oh, last year was 2022 it was 2021 exactly we're in 2023 august 28 2021 i think it was a saturday stroke sunday we were like preparing for church um sunday morning right I, I, so i went to make my hair i remember vividly you guys it was very it was such a very crazy experience I, I went to make my hair on saturday so i think i don't know what happened we got back quite late by late i mean maybe like past maybe like eight o'clock shower or past seven day about so we had to park outside and normally people i mean people park outside so the compound was filled and we just had to like park outside meet like in front of the gates overnight right and that's not the first time even though we don't regularly we don't normally park outside like that but anybody can park outside if you know and there's a there's a this thing i don't know what's called it's just security one security distance shot that we like I, I if i see the name i'll put it my dad gave gave us at some point some years back like we can use it to hold um the steering and then the one of the pedal something like pedal lock yeah pedal lock that's what it's called we, ha we had it you get but i think at that time the security of the car the tr tracker was not i don't think tracker was there but i can't remember but shasha some some of the matter is we parked overnight and by morning like five or six there but when we woke up and like let's be praying for church so like maybe past six or two seven my son was like let him go out and go and <laughs> my goodness my goodness let him go out and go and you know prepare the car like clean it and clean it and then you know like just prepare when we wash it and prepare it for church lo and behold we could not find the car again like you know when you lost when you are looking for something that's that tangible you can literally check anyway we were checking the gutter checking every day you guys nigeria i mean nigeria not happened to you okay but shasha um the previous car got stolen so then we then later got another one which is this black one that we usually use now and you probably must have seen it in the video i'm going to be doing it
they stole our car and then like of course we went to the police station and stuff but you know how nigeria is we even like paid money as usual like they'll tell you to pay money but it's been over a year now but nothing nothing <laughs> i know people prayed we are going to find it all those things we looked for it police people did their own parts but you guys it didn't work so and i saw they don't say like just get get like car tracker all the security you can get then ensure that is insured as well yeah that's really helpful so it's insurance is important like we underestimate the power of insurance I, is that a correct english yeah so but thankfully like the car was insured so we could get the money back you know and then you know get another one but of course you know that cars are like more expensive by the time we got but i mean you can always add money to it it's better than you know not having any money you get like not having any insurance so then I remember again. So when when this first happened, <laughs> Mazza posted this in Ireland. Nigerians are very funny with their comments, and it's not even new to me. But we are just looking at those comments and just laughing, to be honest. But you know, when things have not happened to you, you will feel like, oh, you are the perfect person in the whole wide world. Okay? People were saying all oh, manner of things. Saying you didn't put car tracker. Why didn't you put car tracker? Why is there not so it is car tracker? So you know, like you, you are the best advisor. Keep keep hard warrior. When you think that you can. I'm not saying you should not advise people, right? But there is a manner of which you talk, and then people will know that, oh, okay, this person is advising me. And not you just talk to condemn the person and make the person feel like this is the more. Anyways, we were in a better space, so it wasn't even a, a big deal. It was just more funny than Nigerians and their yeah, yeah, comments. So I was saying, car tracker is important, insurance is important, all the securities you can get are very important. Like, do not undermine one for another. Like, in this country eh, and then i know that it can even happen in other countries as well it's important to just get your guards off for every of your property you get including yourself so don't say you want to do one and not do another because 
it can backfire. So the, um, case in point, when has happened, there was no car tracker, but there was insurance. And remember I said there was pedal lock as well. Now, somebody else, <laughs> another person, it happened to somebody else, right? That the person had car tracker, so does not have insurance so what was said then it was like eh, that if we do car tracker that insurance we don't need to pay they will use car tracker to trace the car right okay this particular person had car tracker but didn't have insurance yes by the time it was overnight as well by the time the person woke up see like tracking the car the car was already in shagam <laughs> okay it's like how many hours and of course because it's midnight the road will be very free so it's as good as oh bye um, now it means car tracker yes you could trace the car but could you actually collect your car back no it's gone it's gone and the fact that there was no insurance the money they are going to have to start all over again like the money nobody's refunding you so yeah but in in this case like when you have the car, car tracker the insurance everything in place you know you can track your car and then if if it's possible to get get it back right you can but if it's not possible you know that you can always um what's it called like you can always get the money refunded from insurance if you're lucky enough you get your money fully refunded without having to stress so much for it because insurance companies too might not pay you fully i mean as at that time the insurance company my husband had like that was where he worked to at that time so it was so much much easier like he got everything refunded and stuff because normally they want to have you get proves that oh this really happened you know and stuff and you know people are very funny people can like start making use of that opportunity lie that their car got stolen or accident and so many other stuff but yeah that's basically the story about how <laughs> the car got stolen though it was it's just funny now it wasn't funny then though. now that i'm just laughing i cried though <laughs> i cried not because like it was the money wasn't going to be funded but it was all stressful to be honest like i mean imagine having a car now and the next moment pew just snap it's gone so yeah may god not allow us to experience that okay <laughs> because but yeah it is well so yeah basically that's it um thanks for watching you guys i'm going to see you guys in my next video Bye.